Hey guys, so this is going to be kind of a large haul. Um, in the background you're probably going to hear my uh, bird talking, but I'm going to try to speed through this as quickly as possible because my indicator light says that the battery is about ready to die and I need to get this over with so I can put stuff away. Um, I'm going to start with what I got on eBay, and it's just these two items. Um, I got the cookie cutter Christmas, or not cookie cutter Christmas, cookie cutter Halloween because the... Um, uh, this is, is, um, retired, or th they don't make it, the words are not happening for me. Um, this was from the hol holiday catalog, and they don't sell that anymore, and they didn't have it in the, uh, clearance area anymore, so I got these two pieces on eBay, so that was cool. I really wanted that set, and I didn't get around to getting it, because everything had kind of exploded at that time. Um, so, uh, this next bit is going to be stamping up one order, then I've got another order that I need to open up, and then I've got some, um, stuff from Amazon and stuff from Hobby Lobby, and we'll get to that. So, I might have to do this in a couple chunks and then splice them together. So, um, I got myself, like, a, oh, and I hope you noticed that I changed the channel name already, so it should say the Pinecone Crafter. But everything else is going to stay the same. Uh, can you hear Indigo in the background? Indigo! Of course, there he is. So, when I get ink, I get the paper and the refill so um, that I have all of them uh, at the same time. That way I'm matching. So, I got the Sahara Sand. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. I got Bermuda Bay, Garden Green, and Early Espresso. These. I think, uh, let's see. I think that looks good together, and I think uh, these two look good together. So that's going to open up some card ideas that I have. So that's those. And I got the matching ink pads as well. Started to unwrap it and then I realized, hey, you know, put that in the haul. So, um, because right now is a uh, celebration, there's a lot of things that, you, that I'm going to say are free, and that's because my order qualified for them to be free um, because of the celebration. I also got myself some um, uh, stamp cases. I got the, the the thin ones. I also got the thicker ones, but I already started using those. Um, the thicker ones are exactly the same size as these wood mount boxes. Um, and I, I use those primarily for making kits for classes or for um, putting my paper pumpkin stuff into. And that's what I was doing in the last video. So I also got, let's see, these are all celebration, I believe. Okay, these are all celebration. So, and if you're interested in joining me um, at Stampin' Up, just let me know. Uh, leave a message here, um, and I can help you get set up. Um, there was this had a box around it, but I uh, took the box out just to because I was all excited about the set. Okay, so this is what came in the set. It this um, uh, Project Life in this kit is called. Hold on. I'll find it. I think it was Hello... Hello something? I can't remember. Oh, it'll be on here. It was called Hello Lovely. So this was the, the kit, and this was the ex accessory pack. So you get this in the kit, which is the paper, the, um, car the cards for your project life. Bunches of different sizes, and there's some stickers in here. Um, and then a stamp set. I don't know if you can see that very well. It's a cute little stamp set. Everything fits in here. Plus the accessory kit, which has washi tape. This is a separate thing. Washi tape. It's got some stencils, I believe, in there. Um, there may not even be stencils. It might just be acrylic um, overlay. And then it's got wooden pieces and some sequins and some stickers and all kinds of stuff, but that also will fit in here. 
So with that, I also got, um, it's from the, what is the name of the kit? Or it's from the Occasions catalog that has the um, Valentine's Day such uh, stuff. And this, the Sending Love embellishments matched pretty well to the wooden embellishment in here. So I got it so that I could use it for my project life. So I'm still keeping going on that. And everything fits nicely in here in the box. So I'm putting that off to the side. Um, the free celebration items I got were the glimmer paper. And that has the Bermuda Bay. I like that a lot. It's got Bermuda Bay, Calypso... Mm -hmm. It's got three colors in here. Anyway, I'm just going to move on because of battery. Yeah. Um, I got the Pretty Pocket, Pretty Pocket Card Kit from the... From the... Uh, uh, celebration. Then I got several of the stamp sets. I got the Any Occasion. I got the Avant Garden. Tasty Trucks. So very much. Hold on. Hey! I can at least get this done, done quick. Um, I got more blocks. I got a block of every size from the Stampin' Up! catalog. And I got a couple of the sizes that I know I'm going to use a lot. Like the C. Yeah, I got a couple C's because those are used a lot. Then, um, let's see. I got some folders. This one is called um, Hexagon Dynamic. It's a thicker one. Those are fun to use. I got more dimensionals. This is uh, Perfect Pines Framelits for the Big Shot. This is the Star Framelits for the Big Shot. And this is a regular embossing folder called uh, Brick Wall. I'm making some graduation cards. So that takes care of those. And that's everything from the first part of the Stampin' Up! order. My sister-in-law is going to be doing scrapbooking with me, so I got a whole bunch of stuff um, to get her started. But not my Stampin' Up! things. Um, so let me sign that. Let's see. That's not what I was getting for her. I got her this, because it's on clearance, and it's got the one in here already and then a backup. And I got some backups for me because they're clearancing them. Um, these dies, the numbers, you can't go wrong with numbers. I got this because this spellbinders die because I really like the uh, banner and then the coffee cup. This because I wanted the arrow and the globe. Okay. Some extreme adhesive with the backup refill. Got some refills for my OTG. And then I got myself some pastel pencils because I'm running low on some of my pastels, but I decided to get the, the pencils instead. Got some watercolor pencils because I've never tried this brand of the watercolor pencils and I really like the, um, the watercolors from them. It's not the best, but I like it a lot. Then something I've been waiting for for a long time. Got myself the Starry Colors uh, Gonsai Tombies. Um, I've been waiting on these for a long time. Putting off getting them. And I got th that all from Hobby Lobby. This I got from uh, Amazon. And this set is called um, it's from Yasumuro. Six piece. It's got pale gold, reddish gold, Chinese white, red, black, and silver. I thought it'd be fun to do a comparison. And those are colors I use a lot of anyway when I'm doing um, calligraphy. 
uh, brush brush lettering. And then I got this set, which is Gonzai also, and it's called Metallic Six Color Set. All metallic-y. I don't know if you can catch that. So I got those. And how much more time do I have? Okay. I'll put these on. And here comes this box. And I just met my goal for um, uh, advancement. So my next goal is, of course, the next level. And maybe, if, again, if you're interested in joining Stampin' Up, maybe you'd want to contact me and I'll help you get set up. Of course, that's only open to people in the United States because of the way they do it. But um, if you're out of country and you wanted to sign up, um, there's a locator, a um, demonstrator lo locator uh, at Stampin' Up's website at stampinup.com. And you can go there and find where one would be located near you that can help you get set up. So let me open this up all the way. And I got a lot of stuff here. Can you see? Got my Cajun Craze ink. Fast Fuse and the refill. Let me see how it compares to the other one. Fine Tip Glue Pen. Marina Mist and Blushing Bride. Hang your stocking. I also got the. Let's see if I can find it. I got the die that goes along with it. So anyway, there's the hang your stocking. That's from the occasions holiday catalog. Then more snail refills. A lot of this I got for free because of um, orders that I'd already placed. Then I got the balloon punch. I got more of the ribbon. I forgot. Let's see. So now I've got two of the ribbon. And it's silver and gold. Got myself always artichoke. By the end of it, I'll finally have all the inks and papers, and then they'll start up a new uh, ink color session. Um, I got the Dynamics die for the cable knit. I have a bunch of ideas for that. A t-shirt builder. It goes with a. It goes with this. That one was called Custom Tea. Birthday banners, and I also got thoughtful banners. I don't know if you can see that. Yes. Okay. And this goes along with the hollow, uh, Halloween one that I showed you earlier, so it can use the same punch. And that was from the holiday one. This is window shopping, and it's got a uh, coordinating die. Is the banner punch to go along with the uh, what's it called? The uh, those two pieces that uh, those two stamp sets I showed you. The Christmas stockings. This goes with the uh, this is a die set that goes with that Christmas stocking one that I showed you earlier. This is another one I got for free. And it's designer tea and it goes along with it. Goes along with custom tea, so you can put these onto the t-shirts. That was a free one from the um, occasions catalog. This is the banner framelits, and it cuts out more of the banners. And I got these for free. These are more of that glimmer paper. The 
the banner punch. I have a feeling some of these are going to be discontinued. I don't know for that for sure, but I have a feeling that some of these are going to be retired in the new catalog, so I've been trying to get a hold of some of the ones that I really like. But that banner punch will cut out that. Um, pair of pizzazz. Another one of, or another two of the Pretty Pocket card kits. Those were free. Refills for my Project Life book. Ink refills for every ink that I got. Three, five, yep. Paper. This is the what is it called? Inside the lines designer paper you can color it. Paper to match the inks. This is the bunch of banners. There's a big banner and there's uh, little banners. The big banners go along with that. Some little ones go with the smaller ones that I showed you earlier. This is Love Notes and it's just, this is from the occasions. Um, catalog, most recent, the one that uh, has the uh, Sealed with Love, and this was a, uh, a bundle with this and this are a bundle, not this. Okay. And then I got a bone folder. I needed to use up some of my um, bonus points. Window box framelits goes with the window shopping set that I showed you earlier. Can't really see inside when I do it that way, but I'm sorry. This is their watercolor paper. Two more of the papers. Their card stock, rather. And because I had all the storage blocks, or not storage blocks, uh, stamp blocks. I got the case to put them in. See, that's what the case looks like on the outside. I don't know if that's going to help. And then you can put them in here. You just got to pull these out. So that they will fit. Okay. And it fits all of them. And then put this in the middle and it keeps them from knocking into each other. Hope you could see all that. And last but not least, there should be the tin. Yes. This is also free in the celebration. tend to put cards into. It's got little dividers. Use it as a recipe box too, I suppose. That's the haul from recent shopping. Um, hope you saw some things that you might be interested in. If you want to see what some of these look like, like this one, if you're interested in seeing what the how the sets work together, just let me know what you were interested in and I will show you. Um, I guess we'll talk to you later. Bye.